Well, I'm with Lewis Anderson of WeBang, and uh, we're standing in front of a very impressive looking rotary machine. And uh, tell me all about it, Lewis. Yeah, so this is our new WeBang Legacy 56 Pro BBC. So BBC stands for Blade Rate Clutch. So for the last number of years, we've been working to develop a heavy duty clutch that can stand up to commercial use. This machine comes with a three year commercial warranty subject to service, and our whole idea was let's make a machine and a clutch that can stand up to the wear and tear. So again, you've got the machine fitted with the clutch and the whole idea is it's got a sacrificial part and that's the wear plate. So when you look here, it's been designed in such a way that if the customer is using it and it's been wearing out over time at a relatively low cost for service and also maintenance, the dealer can replace the part inside the clutch and you can be back up and running. So again, even from an environmental and ecological point of view, it's, it's um, good value for money. So how long is it liable to, to run for before it starts to wear? Again, it depends on the use. So one of the things we can say to you is if you're using any machine in the market with a blade brake clutch, never start it in long, thick, heavy grass. Just lift the machine up, start it with the blade out of the grass so it's less load because it's on that initial startup it wears through. Like I say, we've designed it to be a wearable part, but I, we've got customers that have got six, 700 hours on the machine that have been used in a sensible way. Now, tell me a little bit more about the company. It's not a company I know a great yeah. deal about. But... Yeah, so the company actually was founded in 1997, so it's 25 years old, and we've had a UK subsidiary since 2014, so eight years in the UK. When you look at the whole product range, the R&D and the development is done in the UK, and we also have assembly in the Far East. And I think it's like anything, the product's only as good as the people that are checking it and what you're choosing to build. Like if you look at some of the parts we've got, I take the ratchet mechanism, that there is your standard ratchet you would get to drive the roller for most manufacturers. That there is a rebang ratchet. So again, it might be a brand that might not be as well known or established, but you can see the engineering and the life is what you're paying for. Why, why haven't we heard about you? Where have you been? I th maybe it's the, one of the best kept secrets. Over the last number of years, our sales have really increased and it's all coming from listening to customer and dealer feedback. And I'd say probably in the last two to three years during COVID times, unlike other companies, we've actually accelerated. So we've used the time to actually listen to customers, define and refine the product. And I'd say over the last two years, we've seen huge growth. And it's very much aimed at the commercial market, is that right? Yeah, 100% the commercial market. So our sort of tagline is the commercial choice. And I think that comes from, when you look at some commercial operators like local authorities, councils, and football clubs, they're now choosing WeBang because it's one of the few products on the market that has a three-year commercial warranty, which is almost unheard of for this type of product range. Mm -hmm. And so what sort of market share have you got at the moment and what is your anticipated, what's your, your goals for the next five years? Our goal for the next five years is to grow market share. So if I, I can't talk on percentages, but if I talk about our business, year on year for the last three years we've had double and double and double growth. I'd say next year, even in 2023, with the new products and developments coming out in WeBank, we'll still aim for more than doubling the business. Well, it's very interesting. It's a, as you say, it's a well-engineered uh, piece of equipment and it's got a lot going for it. So hopefully we'll be seeing an awful lot more of the WeBang name. So thanks very much, Lewis. Thank I appreciate it.